to Easy Mind, Easy Life. So, talking about the love that we are and have always been. Something that was, uh, it was tickling my brain today. You know, I'm at work and I'm thinking, it's interesting, right? That we spend our lifetimes collecting all this stuff. We, you know, we get the cars, we get the house, the nice clothes, you know, all this stuff outside of us, right? And we tend to identify with it, you know, this is my car, this is me, right? This is my clothes, this is, you know, me. Again, this is me, this is me, this is me. It's all me, right? We feel like all of this represents who we are. And then I was thinking today, well, how much of that, how much of all this stuff that we collect over a lifetime do we get to take with us? Think about it. If it were so valuable, if it were of, of any value at all, wouldn't we be able to take it with us? If that's what we came here for, to collect all this stuff, to gather all this stuff. We spend so much time getting all this stuff in this lifetime. And we don't get to take any of it with us. You see, for many of us, and let's start again with, we are the love. Yeah, we are the love. For many of us, these things, we do all these things for validation. To have the nice house. And people look up to you because you have the nice house. Or you have the nice car. You know, and people look to you like, wow. You know, she must be doing, she must be successful. She must be, you know, have the good life. People admire you right so you have all these people's admiration but all the while no matter how much stuff we collect on the outside all this stuff because I'm sitting in a room I'm sitting in a house I've got my car just out the window I'm looking at all this stuff and yes we use it it has utility while we're here it's a roof over our head we don't have to get wet when it's raining you know we can get a good night's sleep the car gets us from one point to another we can get to work we can get to places they have functionality but for a lot of us we spend a lot of our energy focused on these things that we're going to connect over this lifetime I just found that funny today. I was sitting there thinking, what does it matter? If the car is worth 10,000 or it's worth 50,000, if it's getting you from one point to the other, and I can't take it with me anyway, yes, I can enjoy it while I'm here and maybe the $50,000 car, you know, it's smoother, it runs better, uh, you know, uh, I don't know, whatever other values you want to add to it. <laughs> Or even the house, you know, you can get a fancy house. And yes, it's comfortable, it's nice, you can live in it. It might feel nicer than living in a house that's dilapidated and falling apart. It might have a nicer feel. But again, at the end of the day, no matter how fancy your house is, you can't take it with you. <laughs> you have to leave it behind. And so this video is more about us identifying that these things that we collect represent us. They are who we are. How many of you feel that way? That you feel that you need these things so that you feel like somebody and not a nobody? Because that's really what it comes down to. That you want to feel like somebody. That people admire you. They look up to you. That you're not just a nobody. That no one notices. So, yeah, I want you to really think about that today. Um, without judgment. Don't be harsh on yourself. But just... You know, these videos are to get you thinking about your life and about 
who you are, who you really are. Why are you really here? What are you doing here? You know? So that's my question for you today. You know, are you collecting all these things? Are they of use? Are you using them because they're of use to you? Or is it more because I want to feel like I'm somebody? Because deep down, I feel like I'm nobody. Think about it. Really think about it. All right, my darlings. So I'm going to leave this one short because you are love. You are the love. And these things that you have to leave behind are not who you are. They're not the real you. So... Food for thought today. All right, my darlings. I love you. Remember to click like and subscribe below so you don't miss any of the messages. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.